Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn notifications on so that you can get the latest notification about my new tutorials. Hello and welcome to Forward Lakes walkthrough videos. Today we are going to look at how to create out of office policy in Gaspersky Endpoint Security. Out of office policy is required to have different settings when a person or a laptop is inside the office and when they are outside the office and not connected to your uh, network. Definitely when we are in an office network we have lots of security uh, mechanism, firewall etc. But when we go out we never know which uh, Wi-Fi, which network we are connecting to, we are, which uh, type of controls we would need in that way. Because sometimes for example you probably would like to allow uh, people to use certain things inside office but when they are going out you probably would like to block them or vice versa maybe you would like to allow them when they are out and when they are inside office you probably would like to block certain things so uh, to do this what you are going to do is you will go to policies if you look over here I don't have any policies because my policies are created on managed devices so I'll go to managed devices and I have one policy named Kaspersky Endpoint Security 10 which is an active policy so what I can do is I can probably just create another copy of it and I'll name it Windows Mobile means this is for my mobile devices and I'll change this to out of office policy alright and to just change certain things I probably would like to enable some settings like in the default policy which I have in office I uh, don't want to show them tasks uh, which are local tasks but when they are outside office I probably would like to allow them to use local tasks so that they can update their antivirus from the uh, internet servers directly they can probably run virus scans and stuff like that so I'll change this also and maybe probably I would like to uh, put some web control on them and I probably would like to block them from certain uh, websites definitely this we are going to talk about in uh, content block or when we will talk about the endpoint control in detail just for the time being I probably would like to block them to have uh, access to any internet based social networking websites for example and I'll say uh, action is block and I'll say always we are going to look into it in details but for now I'm just going to do it uh, over here so I'll move this policy up and I'll apply and say ok to this policy so now my out of office policy is applied um, to this machine and if you look over here the policy is already applied um, now we need to think how Kaspersky would consider if the uh, machine which we are going to look into is in mobile state I mean they are out of office or maybe they are inside the office so the answer to this question is Kaspersky decide on two things uh, one is if Kaspersky network agent from that machine has three unsuccessful attempts to Kaspersky security center and security center cannot reach him for uh, three attempts um, each attempt by default happens in 15 minutes time that is one thing or all the network adapters are disconnected or they are disabled so what we are going to do over here is we will go to Windows 7 machine so now the policy is applied we will come to network adapter settings and we will disable it and once we will disable you will see that we have the tasks which are the local tasks are displayed over here and in the settings the web policy which we applied to control social media is also applied let's open website over here so if it is HTTPS it will not display that it is 
been blocked by Kaspersky if it is HTTP obviously it would show you that this has been blocked by Kaspersky or some warning message should be there so I cannot browse into it so let me just go back enable the network doctor so that we can get the policy updated and you will see in a while that this has turned back and the setting from web control has also changed and now I can connect to Facebook also one more thing which you would need to keep in mind is to apply this out of office policy you need to go to network agent policy and in connection you need to enable this switch to out of office policy when administration server is not available if this is not checked then your out of office policy will not be applied thank you so much for watching for our next walkthrough videos please comment subscribe to my channel and let me know if you need to know more about any of the products i am talking about